I felt that I needed to put out a new video in response to the AAP, the uh, American Academy of uh, Pediatrics, recent new uh, policy statement regarding circumcision, where they basically say that the um, benefits outweigh the risks, and that there is no uh, uh, study that proves that the um, so that the circumcision actually diminishes the uh, um, sensitivity of the penis. Okay, uh, so this is basically probably their uh, response to the recent. Um, actions across Europe, the recent attempts at banning the act, and um, it, it's outright lies, okay? For them to say that it doesn't do anything to regarding, it doesn't de uh, de desensitize the penis is an outright lie. Uh, anybody who's gone through restoration basically knows that, and that's what, basically what I wanted to uh, go over in this video, how you can basically know what you've lost in the act of circumcision. Alright, so here's a penis, right? And as you can see here, uh, there's a nice scar here, and that scar, scar is obviously unnatural, put there at birth, right? Um, well, maybe a week after your birth, but anyways, right? If you want to know what you lost, or have some sort of degree, if you just basically uh, take some of the leftover skin that's here, and you uh, basically stretch it out over the head of the penis, covering the scar, covering the head, and then keep it there. I would suggest using something like duct tape, okay? Something... Like that, and I know it may seem stupid, okay, but what's happened to you is really no stroke of genius either, all right. So what I'm going to ask of you is stupid, but you have to do it, you know, in the privacy of your own home. And uh, like I said, use duct tape. Leave it. Leave the head of your cover, head of your uh, penis covered for a few hours. Try it overnight. Um, ideally, when you wake up in the morning, you'll see how sensitive it is, basically, and what you've lost. It's just to give you a degree, and that's just after a couple of hours, okay. The fact that you've gone your entire life without having the uh, head of your penis covered, well, what you get back in a couple of hours will show you that this is very, uh, um, it's not an accident that this happens, okay? It's not like they circumcise millions of babies every year wondering if, this, wondering if what they're doing is good or not. If it's like, if it's like cooking, adding you know, more or less of a, of a certain spice, all right? It happens for a very uh, serious reason, and that is to diminish your uh, sex drive, okay? It's the same reason why... Um, marijuana is illegal. It's really just a war against enjoying life. And, and if you do what I tell you, take whatever whatever uh, skin you have here, pull it over the head of the penis, duct tape it or some sort of tape. And I, like I said, I know it sounds stupid, but what happened to you is, is no stroke of genius. All right, it's, it's absolutely idiotic. This whole thing that you have to even go through to do this, to try to know what you've lost. Um, but anyways, I suggest you give it a try. And and please. Um, leave reviews, leave comments, tell me if, if it actually worked for you, all right, and if you're not going to do it, then obviously you just don't care that it happened to you, all right, and, and what does that say about yourself, or, or what you want to tolerate in this society, otherwise, please leave reviews after trying what I've told you, and, um, all right, good luck, thank you.